You can use Apple Motion to simulate 3D extruded text. Start by clicking on the text tool. Then type your title within the canvas window. Next, click on the New Camera button. Click on the Switch to 3D button. Use these 3D camera controls to position the 3D camera. Move down towards the bottom of the canvas window and click on the red record button. Then move the playhead indicator forward a few seconds. Go back to the 3D camera controls and reposition the camera back to its start point. Then, turn off the red record button and move the playhead indicator back to the beginning. Click on the text within the canvas window to activate it. Now press the replicate button. Move over to the inspector window. Within the replicator tab, change the shape parameter to line. Change the start point and end point to a value of zero. Click on the 3D option. Twirl down the disclosure triangle for the end point. Adjust the Z-space parameter to simulate the amount of extrusion. Now adjust the number of points until the title becomes solid. Press Command 4 to bring forward the Layers tab. Within the Layers tab, click on the bottom text layer. Move over to the Inspector window and click on the Text tab and then the Style tab. Activate the Glow parameter. Choose the color that you would like for the extruded color of your text. Set the Radius to a value of 12. Okay, that's it. Back up and watch the final composite. For other great tips like this, or to enroll in a Final Cut Pro or Motion training course, visit GeniusDV.com.